hello friends let's look at this next word problem which is of like medium difficulty so the problem statement is out of 40 students 14 are taking English so we have a total of 40 students out of which 14 are taking English and 29 are taking chemistry so if both if five students are in both classes how many students are in neither class so they have mentioned if five students are in both classes right so it means the two circles will intersect because there are some students which are common to both the classes so there will be some part where the the intersection of English and chemistry circles will happen so we have drawn the Venn diagram like this and the intersection portion will have five students as we have mentioned here which which are both in English and chemistry and we are given that 14 are taking English so these 14 they include those who are taking only English as well as those who are taking English and chemistry both so 14 means the complete circle will have, will represent 14 right so how many will be there in this part of the circle 14 minus 5 which is 9 students so 9 students are there who have taken English but not chemistry right so 9 are those and so similarly for chemistry if there are total 29 students and 5 are common to English and chemistry how many will be there having only chemistry 29 minus 5 which is 24 right and in the first problem they have asked how many students are in neither class so in English we English only English let's write down only English we have 9 student and only chemistry we have 24 student and if we write these are the first two first second and the third one is English and chemistry these students are five right and in the class there are total of 40 students so if we add all of them we'll get 38 right so 38 students are there which are in um, in some subject out of these two or in both of them and total we have 40 so if we subtract 38 from 40 we get two these students two students are neither in English nor in chemistry right they are in no class so we have solved the first problem and now the second problem is how many are in either class how many are in either class right so we have all we already know that only nine are in English only 24 are in chemistry we know the answer to the second problem as well now the third question is what is the probability that a randomly chosen student from this group is taking only the chemistry class so when it comes to probability we have to basically find out number of favorable cases divided by probability of anything is given by number of favorable cases divided by number of total cases so in this case what are our favorable cases only the chemistry class so 24 students are there who are only in the chemistry class so if they choose anyone out of those 24 we are good right so our favorable cases are 24 and the total cases are 40 so the probability will come out to be 24 by 40 so these are the chances when we randomly select a student and he comes from chemistry class he is taking chemistry class so we'll divide simplify it to 12 to 20 to 10 to 6 it will come out to be 3 by 5 so the answer to the third problem is 3 by 5 which is the probability required thank you so much if you like please subscribe my channel for more such videos and keep learning happy learning bye for now